Stop. So this is our special Halloween quiz. No, it's our Oween quiz. Can you pass me a tissue? It's our special Oween Hal quiz. As you can see, the boys have put tons of effort into dressing up. None. <laughs> I was wearing this anyway. <laughs> There will be chances for bonus questions, at uh, bonus points. Um, so shall we begin? Oh, this is a mix of Halloween history and pop culture. Okay. Just, uh, Halloween history and pop Halloween pop culture. Another First embarrassing question. way for me to lose. <laughs> First question: Where do jack o' lanterns originate from? Mm. Nice, easy question to start you off. Because when we spoke about the other day. Especially seeing as Georgia gave me the answer in less than 10 seconds. I'm pretty sure this is wrong, but... I know this is right. Three, right. Two. Uh, Sorry. Three, two, one. America. You both You both wrong! Ireland. Ow. Ireland. Yes. Well, never ah, that. I got that right. Apologies to anyone who's now deaf from <laughs> shouting. I was uh, pretty <laughs> sure it was either China or Ireland. I thought maybe it was imported. Oh, I didn't know. No, it was Ireland. Um, okay. And then brought over to America, which is why loads of people think America. it's American. Okay. Uh, yeah. Are you ready for question two? Yeah. Okay. What was the original name for Halloween? I don't know. I can't remember the actual name, so I'm just going to go with... If you know your pagan... Uh, Festivals, you'll know the answer. Yeah, I know. I know what the answer is, but I don't know what it is. I'm learning. <clears throat> I don't know what it is, but I do know what it is. Three, two, one. Wrong. So when? Yep. Spelt something. Quite too easy. Question three. Three. Ready? Yeah. No. What are the names of Casper's uncles? And I want all three. Oh, God. For a point. If you don't know this, then you clearly weren't paying Can't attention last the other night. One. I've got two. <laughs> um. <laughs> I can't remember the third one. We had fun doing the multiple choice in case. Uh, oh, I've got it right. Oh, 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 oh. I've remembered. He's a one. monkey. <laughs> no, I'm not a monkey. You I'm were really making monkey, like monkey like noises. A who? Yeah. A bird. Like a monkey. Three, yeah. two, one. Stretch, stinky, and fat so. Fat so stinky and stretch. See, if I was going for the correct order, Will would be right, but they're both right. Mm. I was trying to stretch uh, first. Yeah, that's right. The, the, uh, Christina Ricci, Liz Fenn, stretch, stinky, and fat so. I think you would stretch in the film, stretch, fat so, and stinky. Well, anyway, so. next question. Yep. Um, and bonus points if you can give me the month and date. No. Right. What year did the original Ghostbusters movie come out? Did the did 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 original did one. Did did did. And was I it? I saw no. it in Tesco today. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't look at it. Um, Bonus if you can give me the months and dates. Complete guess. Three. Yeah, complete guess. Two. One. Fourteenth of October, nineteen eighty-nine. You're both wrong. Of course, it was a guess. Right? Yeah, but it's here. I was close. That was pretty close. I would have asked for the multiple choice, personally. Yeah. Why not? Um, 7th of December, 1984. Oh. Why December? Because they're weirdos. We double-checked oh. this. We were quite far off. Yeah, way yeah. far off. The previous off. videos we've double-checked. More, more! Thank you. Right. <laughs> Question five. Now, you both should know this. Whether you get it right or not, the other thing. Which Halloween tradition did people think would predict the first letter of your soulmate? You both know this. Well, I know this one. Mm -hmm. I know one answer. Georgia came up with this one, and then I said, "Oh, they should know this because it was uh, referenced in a TV program that they've both seen the episode to." <laughs> 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 not recently. Is there a multiple choice? You can have the multiple choice. If you want. Yeah? Yeah, go for it. Carving pumpkins, trick or treating, apple bobbing, or bland and fluff? Three, two, one. Apple bobbing. Apple bobbing. Apple bobbing. Um, it, it was either going to be apple bobbing or Ouija boards. 
in the Charmed Halloween episode when they get sent back to the past. Yeah. She picks an apple out of the water. Right. And the guy carves it for her, like takes the first bit of peel off for her to eat. Mm. And he puts it back in the water, remember? And it shows the letter C for Cole. Oh, yeah. Which was actually meant to be for Cupid. Question six. Which vegetable was originally used for jack-o'-lanterns before pumpkins? You can have a multiple choice if you nope. like it. Or not. I don't know. No, it's not over this, is it? No. Uh, oh, I'm not okay. okay. <laughs> it wasn't going to be that. Three, two, one. Turnip. Yeah. Uh, Melon! I think it's very big and hollow, like a pumpkin. But Okay. I originally had apples, so... Well, I think... If it's come from Ireland... Pumpkins aren't native to Ireland, Ireland, are they? What is? Potatoes. <coughs> that's native to South America. They were imported right, into Ireland. Sure. What's the name of Jack Skelton's dog in the Nightmare Before Christmas? I think it's spelled... Is it spelled in there? Three, two, one. Zero. Zero. Without an X. Without the X. Is it an X? What? It's a Z, well, not an X. Saying, that's what it was spelled differently. Yeah, it's spelled with a Z. Give him that point or not? Point oh, oh I was... think we need the adjudicator back. Yeah, yeah just um, carry on asking yeah. when she gets back. <laughs> How many siblings does Wendy Adams have? And Wendy. I'll give you... Wednesday. Uh, Wednesday. And I'll give you a bonus point if you... Can name them. No. No, I cannot. Don't know the other one. So I'm just going to go with that. Three, two, one. Two. Is he wrong? <laughs> Is he's right? Is he's right? <laughs> I've never seen the film. Yeah. You've never seen any of the Adams Family films? That is shocking. Oh. Where? At all. Why did people originally dress up at Halloween? What? Why did people originally Why? dress up at Halloween? Fucking no. That's a fussy cut. Multiple choice. No, clearly got money. Just take a guess. Why do kids dress up? Okay, why do we. Yeah, sweets! Mm, just leave him, he's happy. Okay. <laughs> Two, one. To scare people. Cause the two answers are right. Geistings. No, he's, mm. Geistings started off to protect yourself from spirits. However, it evolved in time to uh, going door to door singing, caroling uh, Halloween songs for kids. No, no, technically, is he's right. Because he's on about the spirits, which is what Ayla's put to scare away the evil version, spirits. And then after Christian. So if he's right, he's just worded it. it differently. To trick the spirits. Yeah, basically. Sorry, wrong. Uh, again. I'm going to get maybe two this time. I think Izzy should get an extra point for that because he got both versions of it. Uh, Question nine. I also got the original name. Did she do the bonus points for question eight? Yeah, yes. but we didn't get the yeah. names. Um, oh, we right. also need a ruling. They both put zero, but well, Will spelt it, it with zero, an X. I put an X because I thought it wasn't with a Z. It was... I can't believe you guys got question eight wrong. I got it right. I, I didn't get the right. extra point. I got it wrong. Oh, okay. Uh, I've never seen the film. Is that guising? Geisting. It's not geisting, it's geising. Well, yes, yeah, so I read it wrong. To trick the spirits and go door to door singing Halloween songs for cake. Technically right. Which is what I said. It evolved in time to... What did Will uh, put? I just scare people. Well, I'd give the point to Izzy because he's correct. Yeah. It was to scare away evil spirits, so... Apologies, I'm Yay! Wait. Question 10. What are black cats associated with? But who are they associated with, sorry. So you'd know a lot of this if you watched Charmed. I have watched Charmed for a long time. Is that eyeballs in that Three, jar? This is two, probably wrong. One. Witches. Yep. Both of you correct. I've actually got a point. 
They are called familiars. Mm -hmm. And can be black cats, but also can be frogs or okay. rats or whatever. Okay. Um, Why do you want a frog? Oh. This frog's cool. Question 11. What are the names of Sabrina's aunts? Mm. I don't know. Oh my <laughs> god! I don't. You said I could put whatever I wanted in. You have to put something down. I'm not giving them all the One of the names is quite highly in. Okay. <laughs> Three. I was busy trying to help you actually. Yeah. <laughs> Three, two, one. Any person I know in the program, Melissa Joan Hart. <laughs> Hilda and Zelda. Correct. She played Serena. I know. Question 12. How many Tim Burton films has Helena Bonham Carter oh, been in? God, we went over this. Bonus points. Forgotten. Right? Yeah. Uh, bonus point for however many you can name afterwards. Oh, obviously I was going to say bonus point for the list of who was after her. The characters she's named. No, I meant the list after her, who was no. the most popular. No. Still know the answer for that. <laughs> <laughs> I always had that one, sorry. Mm, I can't think of the characters' names. I don't go into that much detail as who plays who, and I say I'm really excited about said person. Ready? I've only got two characters' names, but that'll have to do. Two, one. Eight. Eight. You're both wrong. Okay. It's nine. Okay, but I've got Red Queen and The Witch from Big Fish. Okay. Right. Nine films because there's been two Alice films now, if you think about it. Oh. Which, when we looked the other day for the Tim Burton quiz, hadn't been included. Yeah. But that was fine. Oh, um, and she, she has played... Mrs. Bucket, Emily the Corpse Bride, Mrs. Lovett, The Red Queen Twice, um, Dr. Julia Hoffman from Dark Shadows, and I don't have the name here, but a character in The Lone Ranger, in addition to a character in Planet of the Apes. And The Witch and The Music Teacher in Big Fish. Exactly. Right. Which country celebrates, this is an odd one, celebrates the tradition of hiding all your knives from evil spirits on Halloween? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> you can have the multiple traits. I'll have the multiple traits. Oh, all right. I'm looking for something stupid like Uzbekistan or something. No. Italy, Spain, Germany or France? The only reason why this one got put in is me and George are sorry and thought this is too weird not to put in. <laughs> mm-hmm. Three, two, one. Italy. Germany. Germany. For God's sake. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like a German thing to do. I mean, they put their Christmas presents in shoes. <laughs> Question 14. What dates are Dea Della's motto commonly celebrated on? Three, two, one. Second to the third. Will's right. Oh. First and second of November. <laughs> I should get about ten, <laughs> I'll get I should get about ten bonus points for that. Not only did I get it right, I beat Izzy. You <laughs> should get a bonus point for getting both dates right, because I was going to allow if you'd just got one. So I get one. Do we allow him second? to have one? I got the second. I, 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 I was going to allow a point if you said the 31st, because some Mexicans celebrate the 31st to the 1st, if they can't do the second. Okay. I've left it up no. to the committee and they've said no. I didn't say anything. <laughs> I feel betrayed. <laughs> what do you want to do? Right. Question 15. What is Scooby Doo's full name? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! You can have a multiple choice if you would like. I like a multiple choice myself. Yeah. How about you? Yeah, right? I know it ends in do. A. Scooby Doo Bert. B. Scoobert Dubert. Sorry, that's really hard to say. C. Scooby D Dubert. Or D. Scoobert Do. Okay. Three, two, one. Scoobert Do. Scoobert D Dubert. Scooby D Dubert. Bill's right. I knew, I knew, I knew it ended with Do. <laughs> I thought he'd have a middle name, I just thought he would. I thought no, he did, but his, I knew it ended with uh, Do. So. Middle name is his nickname, Scooby. So. 
16. How many times do you need to say his name to summon Beetlejuice? Three, two, one. Three. Yes, mm -hmm. you both right. I beat my my uh, guess of five. <laughs> seven. Wait, uh, what? Judge. Six plus a bonus point. He counts the uh. bonus point. Right. Question seventeen. Mm -hmm. What three symbols are associated with Diadella's mother? Three. Yeah. I'll give you a point. For what the? I'll give you a point for every correct answer. Symbol. Mm hmm So, what three things would you symbolise with Daredevil's Motto? Three, two, one. I've got a snake, a skull and a spider. I've got a candle, a skeleton and a grave. Bill gets one point as he gets none. Was it a skull or the right one? Skulls, flowers and butterflies. Oh, I should have known flowers. Mm hmm 18. What phrase is written under the numbers on a Ouija board? So imagine a Ouija board, what is written underneath the numbers? Oh, I think I know this. I think I know this. I don't think I know this. Three, okay. two, one. Yes or no? You're both wrong. Oh, that's that's at the top. Oh. It's... Told you? It is. If I remember rightly, it's... She doesn't. Good. Bye. Yes. Oh. Underneath the numbers, you have goodbye. Because on most Ouija boards. Because if you want to because if you want to say goodbye to the spirit, you have to wave it round to say goodbye to them, or they just stay there and haunt your house forever. Question nineteen. What year did Casper the Friendly Ghost come out? <laughs> Flaming Hell <house>, say. <laughs> Stop it. You mean the movie or the, the movie. comics? Say? The movie. Yeah, go for it. Three, two, one. I think it was 95. 2001. 95. Oh. I even said yesterday, oh, the special effects are really good for 1995. Uh, <laughs> I thought it, this was the one where we were on about it being like a few months younger than me, but that was yeah. Tower of Terror. Yeah, I did say you could have multiple choice. That's boring. Right, last question. If you both don't get this, we'll be shocked. Who played the first Dracula in movies? <laughs> Can anybody know this would be Izzy? Because okay, I'm gonna. I I know what answer you're after, but it's wrong. Don't look at me. I didn't write the question. Well, look at me. I only googled the answer. <laughs> <laughs> but you should know the answer because we talked about it for weeks. Mm -hmm. Come on, Molly. Let's put something down. We, we only got... I'm reading what's on the page here, and she Googled it. Ready? Three, two, one. Bob Bobbington. <laughs> Bella Lugos. Yes. But uh, it's not because Nosferatu was a silent Dracula film. And, well, we uh, were after a talkie. Okay, a talkie. <laughs> a talkie. Call it a talkie. It was definitely Bob Bobbington. <laughs> <laughs> right. Um, can we pause a second? Yeah. Will has seven, mm -hmm. and Izzy has ten. Okay. And bonus points. How many did they each get? Three for Izzy and one for Will. Okay. <laughs> so, thirteen for me. Mm-hmm. That looks like you got eighty. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, we haven't written down this week for next week, so what is it? Um, because I'm not that great at it and I want to give Will a fighting chance, so I've picked something that I am equally not as good at as Will is not as good at. I'm going for musicals. 